we relentlessly strive to keep ahead of emerging trends in the marketplace. Our latest research report, Big and Small, How to Do Bigger Things in Business, in conjunction with our specialist Connected World research partner, CCS Insight, explores the dynamic between big and small businesses. And it's highlighting a previously unrecognized productivity gap in larger organizations and urges deeper collaboration with smaller businesses. Small organisations are dependent on their technology and the people therefore tend to get the technology they really need for their business. So on the whole I think in small businesses employees are happy with the technology they've got. Employees in large organisations have always struggled with the technology they are being offered because they usually don't have much control over it. Uh, unlike employees in small startup, uh, they don't have the flexibility to uh, uh, choose the type of technology they need in order to boost their productivity and performance. Large organizations are looking at incubators and accelerators as a way to actually boost innovation. We are witnessing that more of our clients are looking at this opportunity as a way to uh, drive innovation forward. Startups must keep innovating, otherwise they're going to fail. And that's because they're not in a position of strength in the marketplace. The only way they can possibly compete against much larger, larger companies is by innovating. And so it becomes the heart and beating soul of a startup company. Startups in the tech world obviously take cybersecurity really seriously. But I think some other small businesses don't. And I think they need to learn that this is a really important factor if they want to work with bigger businesses. If I was advising a big business about working with a startup, I would ask them to put themselves in the startup shoes. So issues that don't seem to matter to big businesses, like how long it takes to get onto the purchase order system really matter to small businesses. Cash, cash, cash is king for a small business. Small businesses can learn a lot from big organisations. The first one is to be authentic and uh, be true to their values, be human into the way they deliver a service or a product. And the second one is to believe into the value of experience and really understand customership, understand people around their product, around their services.